Uh, my name is Jim Harkin, I'm a technology manager at, with the MNL based here at the Workington Laboratory. This is the BP Robots project, uh, which has been used to uh, develop and optimise equipment to uh, remotely handle uh, legacy nuclear waste from a number of donor facilities on the Solarfield site. So we're actually using uh, standard robotics uh, to remotely handle the, uh, the nuclear waste, uh, cut it up as required, then package it into waste liners, which will then be filled with grout to encapsulate the waste. My name is John Eaton. I'm on the BEP project working for Sellafield Limited and I work with the robots. We've been working with the NNL for the last three years and we've got a very good collaborative working arrangement with the NNL and we've been developing the robots in an innovative manner using uh, teleoperation mode so operators are controlling the robots to deliver the benefits that we're looking for and we're using commercial robots and commercial tooling to deliver this benefit. Uh, it's often been stated that this, this project potentially is a game changer for the nuclear industry in, in the UK. Um, yes, robots have been used in uh, radioactive environments before but perhaps not in such onerous conditions and perhaps not with the uh, difficult tasks that have to be performed on these robots. Uh, the working in an extremely uh, radioactive environment, but it's, it's wet, it's dirty, it's sludgy. They have to work for long periods with high performance and extremely high levels of reliability.